Hello, hello. Welcome back to the channel, guys. Today I wanted to share with you a video uh, regarding the micro SD card that goes inserted into the drone. Now, many online have been saying that it only accepts a capacity, a storage capacity of 32 gigabytes, and I found that not to be true. So I'm going to go ahead and show you that you can use a 64 gigabyte micro SD card class 10 on the JJRC X12. So let me go ahead and change that card. I'm going to do that here so you guys can see step by step. I'm going to remove the one I have inserted already, which is a SanDisk 32 gigabyte extreme card. It's pretty fast. Place that here. And now I'm going to insert the 64 gigabyte card. This one's made by Transcend. Um, and it is, it is a class 10. So I insert the card. Always put the graphic down, facing down. That's how you insert it properly. And you just push it down till you hear that little clicking sound. All right. So first things first, what you have to do prior to inserting that 64 gigabyte card is you have to put it in your computer and you have to format it. So it comes formatted, uh, 64 gigabyte micro SD cards usually come formatted in the XFAT. So you have to reformat it into a MSDOS FAT or FAT32 format. And once you do that, it should work fine. So let me go ahead and connect it and show you guys that it does record and turn this on. Sorry for the loud noise. I wish you can turn that, that uh, sound off, but unfortunately you can't. Okay, so you turn on the controller, you get green lights, that means it's paired to the drone now you go ahead and you go into your Wi-Fi settings and you wait. You don't want to connect to where it says drone. You want to connect to the controller itself. So I'm just going to wait a minute until I get that connection. All right, so here we go. Controller. Uh, by the way, that is your serial number. And the, the one, two, three, four, five, six, those six digits at the end of it is the serial number. So in case you guys want to register it. All right, so I'm going to connect to that. Waiting for it to connect. All right, we're connected. Now we're going to go into the Enjoy Flight app and bind it. Bind is a success. And you just press Start Flying. Now we're indoors. I'm not going to be doing any flying indoors, obviously. So as you can see, the the uh, camera is now turned on and uh, this is just for testing purposes so I'm showing you the bag the carry-on bag and what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to press record so now it's recording you see the little icon with the camera turned blue that means it's recording you see it counting up so I'm going to you know, just show you quickly, do a little uh, movement of the camera here, of this bag, just for a test. All right, so that's it. I'm going to turn that off. Now I'm going to take a quick uh, picture as well. So just press that. All right, and I've taken a picture. So now I'm going to go into... In the app, I'm going to go to my folder, which is at the bottom. And you can see it says photos, video, and camera. So you see nothing's popping up on photos and video. That's because that is when you store it directly via the app into your phone. So when you go to camera, that's the SD card. So I'm going to press camera. And now you see it pop. It, it, you can see it it's there it's loading 
has to load everything. Waiting, waiting, waiting. Now, it might take a while, but anyway, they're there. All of that information is stored into uh, the SD card, so it does work. Just to verify that, I'm going to put it into my computer, and I'm going to show you guys that I can access everything that I just uh, did. I'm going to remove the card. As you can see, I'm doing this step by step. That's the Transend 64 gigabyte card. All right, so I got my uh, micro SD card reader. What I'm going to be doing is inserting it now. Uh, it goes this way. All right, turns blue. All right, so as you can see, I have inserted the uh, a micro SD card, and it's in this folder. So now I'm going to I'm going to access that folder, open it up. You see here that I have photos and video. First, I'm going to click on the photo file, and right there, you see the photograph that I just uh, took with the drone. Now I'm going to go to video, click on video, and here you see the video that I just recorded. So yeah, you can record with a micro SD card of 64 gigabytes uh, with the JJRC X12. So just format it, and that's it. You're ready to go. All right, thank you so much, guys, for tuning in. I hope you enjoyed this uh, video, and if you do, if you did like it, please give it a little thumbs up on the bottom. And if you want to see more videos like these, just subscribe to the channel and uh, click on the little notification bell so you can be notified every time I do upload a new video. So once again, thank you so much, and you guys have a nice day. Bye.